Okay, so I'm outside this um, this revamped restaurant. I've been here oh, a couple of years ago. I did a Christmas video here. Um, the name of it is Golsha. There's a couple of these in uh, in Denpasar. This one here is in Renon. So uh, what I'm going to do is go in and uh, give you an idea of what the place is like. It's been revamped. We've got upstairs as well now. So. Um, it's a really, really nice place at the moment. Probably, probably one of the nicest places in, uh, you know, between Sanur and Renon, and uh, maybe some of the others in Denpasar. So uh, we'll go inside and uh, and have a look and see what's happening. So it's pretty early at the moment. Uh, it's only five to six. So uh, what we have down here. Hello, girls. How are you? I'm fine. You're both fine. I checked it. Hello, what did that mean? Ah, right, oh, I'm healthy now. What do you hold this for me? Same thing as the. Put this on. <laughs> so put, must put the mask yes, on. Yes, you can. Okay. Terima kasih. Terima kasih. You're a good girl, eh? Okay, yeah, I go up to. But here, this area here, let me just zoom around quickly. This area here is the ice cream section. And this girl here is ordering ice cream. I don't know why they're so slim, these girls. So they eat ice cream and. Actually, I feel bad. <laughs> I eat ice cream and I fill out. But a, this is gelato. A very, very good selection. And a medium cup. There's some prices there. Look, a medium cup. $2.50. Large cup, $3.50. This is Australian prices. Family cup, 105 Medium this girl is going for the... Yes, I can like... Um, what are you having? Save some space for... What are you having? Little, small or large? I'm gonna have the small one. Okay, good. Yeah. Good. Think of your diet. What about you? I not eat. I eat upstairs. Oh. No. It's no good for me, this. Although I could eat lots of it. But have a look at the selection. It's beautiful. Have a look how clean it is. Okay. Lovely and clean. Okay, enjoy yourself. So yeah, there's uh, plenty of seats here for uh, for anybody. This place packs up of a of a night time. We'll go upstairs now. This is the eating area. Um, I don't know how many people are up here, so I might turn the video off until they get some people here. But uh, oh no, there's a few people here. Let's have a look. Yes. So as you can see, it's a very, very large area. And as you can see, it's mainly Indonesian. So outside there, they have a smoking area. A nice relaxing lounge is over there. And uh, Here's one of the staff. We'll go down here and have a look. Hello. Some of these girls might be a bit intimidated by a camera thrust in their face. You're still here. All day you stay. Hey, all day. I don't know. Hello. You were here before too, eh? Were you here before? Yeah. Yes. Because it is stranger this one. <laughs> okay, so we'll go over here and have a quick look. But I'm going to. Uh, oh my God! Look at all these cheesecakes and what have you. 
Too bad my sugar is up. Look at that. Beautifully presented. Well cooked, well made. This is truly one of the best restaurants around. And uh, what they have over here, you don't see too much of this in uh, in Bali. It's the uh, big oven. Is that oven on now? Cooking? If not cooking. Heating up, okay. I'll come Bali later. We're going to have a quick uh, browse through this menu. Um, I'll mention the prices in uh, in Australian dollars, so you get a well, it's a rough idea anyway. So the grilled chicken salad is uh, forty thousand. It's about four dollars, five dollars sixty for the salmon salad, um, tuna fish cakes. $2, about two dollars seventy, down to two dollars fifty for the meatballs. Don't ask me what that name is up in in the top there, but uh, salmon mente sauce croffle, whatever croffle means. Somebody can tell me in the comments. Um, they're three dollars seventy. We're going oxtail soup, it's 57. Now, that oxtail soup is pretty good. You got grilled chicken there for $4.20. Half a grilled duck. Um, you, you gotta watch those grilled ducks, they're very, very small. And they, they cook the hell out of them, so uh, I don't recommend a grilled duck. Have a go at that. That's a hamburger. How much is a hamburger? I can't read it. There's eye operation, it's hard to, hard to focus at the moment. Lamb chops, 82. Lamb is very expensive here in Mali or Indonesia. Barbecue beef ribs, beef's pretty expensive too. I think this is uh, imported beef too. Barbecue sausages, $4.30. Tenderloin steak, which is starting to get up now this is uh, imported stuff nine dollars around nine dollars sirloin six dollars eighty so say seven dollars seven dollars for tenderloin i better rush through this will take forever you get an idea this thing's slipping around a bit beef mix grill yeah, that's over ten dollars, so that's pretty expensive. For me, it is. Chicken parmigiana, which I'm going to have tonight. Chicken cordon bleu. I've had one of those here before. Chicken and mushroom looks pretty good. I must try that one day. Now uh, yeah, we come into the fish. So salmon is pretty expensive over uh, over a dory. Parmigiana. And then you get to uh, spaghetti, around a four dollars thirty mark. Lasagna, about four dollars. Those plates are not bad sizes actually. Uh, Gosha beef curry, forty-five. So you can see anything with beef in it, it's pretty expensive. Now the pizzas. I had a pizza the other night. I had it delivered from here, um, which was really nice. And they're about seven dollars. Not a bad size either. I did manage to eat it by myself and uh, didn't have any problems there. Margarita, 60, well, that's six dollars. Six dollars seventy for beef rashers, whatever that is. Vegetarian, salmon, nearly eight dollars. Oh, now you come to the sweets, which I'm not allowed to have because my sugar, blood sugar thing is skyrocketing oh look at these things all right i'll leave it at that because uh, i don't want to be tempted into those sweets so that gives you an idea of what the meals are here so uh, i'll wait for my meal to come and then we'll have a look at that okay so uh, my meal has arrived and have a look at that isn't that exquisite 
Well, if you don't get salt and pepper with anyone, I guess you're going to ask for it. But this looks, look at these French fries. Am I allowed to eat French fries? I don't know. I'm on a bit of a diet, but I'm going well, so I guess tonight's not going to hurt. That's no, tasty. I like the little plates. Uh, it's like a plastic cover and a wooden, wooden disc thing, you know? Okay, let's get into this and see what this tastes like. I haven't seen Bill Parmigiana in, uh, in Indonesia yet, but uh, chicken Parmigiana takes a pretty good place in second. Yeah, can't complain about that. It's pretty good tucking that. Sauce is right. Cheese is right. I love that mozzarella cheese. It sticks to everything. As you can see. Salad, mayo. Not bad value for, I don't know what this cost, I think it was about four dollars. So not bad value. Pretty damn tasty. Love those chips. It's a shame you got all these chips out of uh, out of a diet when you're, when you're serious. That is. But uh, I haven't had fried food for oh, probably a, a month or two now. Lost a bit of weight. White rice is not good for you either. But all Indonesians eat rice like going out of fashion. There's a hell of a lot of slim ones around. Very popular place this at my time. I came here today at lunchtime. It was probably about 20 to 30 people in. It's filling up now. Probably what's the time? It's quarter to seven. So I guess uh, I guess by seven o'clock, eight o'clock, there's still a few tables left. <laughs> The other night when I came back from the hospital, I dropped in here for a coffee. I had to wait 10 minutes to get a seat. Table. Unbelievable. I think I said, mentioned before that I reckon between Sanua Beach and Denpasar, this place has got to be number one on the, on the cards. It's, uh, so clean. Well, I, yeah, I mean, it's new, but even before in the old place, it was very, very clean and tidy, and the staff were good. Can't complain about the service. I ordered that meal. It probably took me probably took about five minutes before I got the meal. So, you know, can't complain about that. The boys, they've got a 
a pretty good menu, as you, as you saw before, you know. Yeah, these chips, hey. Bad serving, is it really? When you think about it, that's a, not a bad sized chicken there. Quite a few chips. I think I'll probably be full after this. I mentioned in a previous, my last video I think it was, that I'm going to do a, uh, probably a four, three to four part series on different restaurants and I'll use part of this um, and include it in the, in the, video, the new videos. But what I'm going to do is go from uh, probably you know, like a classy restaurant like this down to you know the, the warrums that you see along the streets everywhere you know the, where you just get noodles with a bit of hot water and cost you 50 cents you know and so it gives you an indication of um, where the Indonesians go for a tucker. I haven't seen any westerners in here because it's a little bit out of the road from uh, like you know the main street of, of Sanua um, previously, before the before the um, virus hit us over here, um, there was a lot of uh, a lot of Westerners living in some in uh, Renault area. No frequent places like this. Um, but if you really want to get adventurous, uh, try some of those other places. If you just want a snack or. You know, if you just want to try something else, something a little bit different from what most people do, Westerns come here, they look for Western food after they've had their nasty drawings and, uh, you know, um, me, I am, like, you know, uh, chicken and noodles and stuff like that. Um, and in those, you know, those higher class restaurants, it's not true Indonesian food, It's it's got a Western uh, touch to it. So. Get out in the streets and uh, get in a taxi and get them to drive you around to, to see a place that you've got to see a place that's got a lot of people, you know, quite a few people, say five to ten people eating in it. Duck in there and, uh, and try the takaria, which is the original Indonesian food, you know. You won't be surprised. And the price, oh my god. You know, we're ranging here in this restaurant from a fancy steak, imported steak, from $10 down to about probably $4 for a, for a good meal like this. Whereas in those other places you wouldn't pay over a dollar. And the tucker's alright too. But this meal here is beautiful. Really, really nice. Been a bit of a while since I've uh, been out and about to restaurants like this. I usually uh, hang around the other places. I put this one on the cards now. I might come here once a week or something like that until I get annoyed with me. Not hard to do, of course. Anyway, I'm going to book into this and finish her off. We'll talk to you later on. Well, short of looking the plate, that's empty. Except for these two little sauces. I think this one here is. Uh, it's hot sauce and that, no that'll be hot sauce and that's probably tomato sauce so uh, 
I didn't need that with the sauce that was on that on that chicken. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. And I wash it down with uh, my calorie free pure water. Look at that having high sugar, eh? All the things I'm going to miss out on them. Ice cream, that ice cream parlor down the way. Looks superb. Me being as strong as I am, I refrain from. Uh, oh, pardon me. Refrain from eating that. And go past it on the way out real quick. And the cakes. Cakes that are over there. I won't even look inside. I won't even look. Okay, so uh, that about wraps it up for uh, for uh, Gosha uh, restaurant here in Renon. I'll leave a link um, or a map as to where it is uh, in the video so uh, when and if you ever get back here um, try it out because it's, uh, it's absolutely superb. There's no entertainment or anything like that. It's just a nice restaurant. Can't, uh, can't go wrong with it. So until next time, um, keep safe. And we'll see you in the next video. Oh, hit that uh, record button and the bell icon to get notified of get notified of uh, the next videos that are coming. That's all those food videos. I think you'll, uh, you'll be surprised at the places where I eat at. So. Anyway, good luck. See you next time. Thing, checking everybody as they come in. Okay, darlings, Sampa Jupalagi, eh? Kambali, yeah. Bye bye. Bye bye. So there you go, what a night. Beautiful. As you can see, a ton of motorbikes here. Yeah, what a restaurant. Fantastic. Staff are great, having about it.